So my skin was having this weird reactive thing going on where I was almost getting not hives, but like breaking out right here and having what looked like some kind of reaction to something I had tried, whether it was like a foundation, because I had been trying a bunch of foundations. There was one month where I was like trying a bunch of different foundations or skincare, I was like switching it up. And so for the past probably month and a half, I've completely pared down my skincare routine and I'm only using very specific things and it is so minimal and so simple, but I feel like my skin is back to looking really good and not breaking out and it's kind of calmed down. So I'm gonna keep going on this for a little while and I love the simplicity of it because if I travel, I have like less to take with me, like it's just so easy. So I'm gonna show you guys all of my current favorite things um, that are minimal skincare summer routine for a sensitive skin or if you're like having a breakout. So let's do it. Okay, now let's get into it. So I start with this Summer Fridays Super Amino Gel Cleanser. I have found this is like a purifying cleanser. I have found that it is really gentle on the skin. It smells good. I like it. It takes my makeup off. I'll usually use this with one of those like Amazon cloths. I'll link it below. It's like a um, washcloth, but it helps you take your makeup off, kind of like a makeup eraser, anything like that. I pair with this guy. I use it morning and night, but it does take my makeup off at night too, which is a really nice perk. So then I go in with this little baby and this has been like my holy grail for the past month or two. It's a Clinique Moisture Surge Intense. I actually used to work in the beauty department at Nordstrom and I sold so many of these from Clinique because they're so good. It's crazy hydrating. It's really good for sensitive skin. So I've been using this little guy morning and night and I've already gone through these. I actually have been using these longer than two months. It's just been like the only thing I've been using for the past like two months. And then I go in with my Summer Fridays Light Aura Vitamin C Eye Cream. I really like this stuff as well. It just gives like a nice brightness under the eyes. And then I literally go in with my sunscreen. Like that is how minimal the skincare routine is. It's kind of crazy, but I feel like my skin hasn't looked this good in a long time. And it's just such a simple pared down routine until I can start incorporating those actives back in and that SkinCeuticals, like I love those products. And those are things that I love, like the vitamin C and all that, but my skin just needed a break to really, I don't know, chill out from all the foundations and like other stuff that I had been trying. So then I go in with one of two sunscreens. One is either the Tinted Elta MD. This one is really good. If I want something with the tint, I love this one. I've actually used this one for years. And then I recently saw that Hailey Bieber talked about using this one, so that was cool. Or if I want a glow, I use the Tula one. And then for lips, I like the Laneige Sleep Mask. And for body, I have been obsessed with the Tula Take Care and Nourish Advanced Hydration Body Moisturizer. I actually got to try this. Tula, a couple of the girls from the Tula team came here months before they released this and I got to sample it. And so I've actually used this for a long time and I love it. It's very hydrating and it gives a glow. And that is literally it for my super pared down skincare routine. Like literally it's an eye cream, a moisturizer, a sunscreen, and a face wash. Like, that's it. It's wild. So I will link everything below. Let me know if you guys have questions, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.